What's up YouTube? Sindel here once again with Sins Collectibles for the third time trying to make this darn video. It's just not my day and everybody's trying to bother me. So I'm just going to show you all the stuff in these boxes. Um, specifically the BAM Original and the BAM Horror Box from February 2018. So in the first original box I did receive a 1UP. Yes indeed I did. But we'll get to that later. The first item is this FBI X-Files show replica ID badge. And there's that. The next item is this um, brass heavy chip, T T100 chip, I think. It is the T800 CPU brain chip replica. Brass Edition by Dark Matter Pops. So that is that. Has quite the weight to it. Um, so yeah, we all know that there's no pins in this box, and it makes me sad face because we all know how much I really like the pins. But um, I don't. I haven't really been on um, the page too much, so I don't know what the deal is with everything at the moment. So we're gonna go with the first art print, which is the Black Panther print. Uh, it's a fan art collection art print called Wakanda, but hand signed by Kyle Willis. This is the regular version, and it's numbered 1,354 out of 2,000, and his autograph is right there in gold lettering. Um, let's see. This is the variant you could have gotten, I believe probably out of 500, yes. Um, the next item, which is my one-up item, is the Harley Quinn print, uh, and it's called Harley Girl, hand-signed by artist Nathan Surdy, 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 and it's numbered 500 out of 500, and it just reminds me of the other Harley Quinn calendar prints that we received in the past. Um, yeah, and then the regular one is this one right here. I, didn't, I only seen some slight differences, so I mean. And then the last item is an autograph from Smallville. This is the one of three I could have received. Um, hand signed by Laura Vandervoot, who plays Kara or Supergirl. And signed during the private signing. So that is the one I received in my box. And then there's these other two you could have probably received. Um, then, like always, they're doing a giveaway. It's um, a Harley Quinn pop signed by Tara Strong, who voices Harley in the video game, in a video game. Um, then we have the themes for this month. So yeah, I finally got through that part, that box, yeah, without any interruption. Um, and then it was the Bam Horror Box. So the first item was the My Bloody Valentine item, and it's just card, red cardboard, heart-shaped, chocolate-looking box with a stress ball, heart-shaped, stress toy, I guess, um, that, you know, has like paint, blood splatter, and some tissue paper in a box. What a lovely present to give someone that you really don't like. Or you do like, and you know, pretending to beat your heart, but I don't know. <laughs> the next item in the box is the first print. Yeah, that's, so that was the only, like, prop in there. There's no pins, no nada, no nada. Even though there's two prints in each box, it still missed my pins, and yeah. So it is the Captain Spaulding print. It is the regular fan art collection, um, hand-started. Hand signed by artist L.V. Bart, guaranteed to be authentic, and it is numbered 821 out of 1,500. So that is that. And then the next um, print, which is my favorite thing out of both boxes, just completely favorite thing out of both boxes regardless, is the It print of Georgie. Um, and it's hand signed by artist James Busema. Busema. Uh, and it is numbered 668 out of 1,500. 
so we all know that I love me some uh, it and Pennywise and all that. But I did really like how the, um, it looks like glowing red eyes, but if you look closer, they're the red balloons. Um, I knew I, would probably, I had a feeling I wasn't going to get the variant in my box, so I did purchase that one off eBay already for $25 and some change. So that one should be there because I need to have both complete sets. I already have both of the Pennywise prints, so yes. Um... Oh, yeah. Let me show you the last item, at least. Come on. And then the last item is the autograph from the movie Jigsaw. That's what it looks like. And it is hand-signed by Laura Vandervoot, who played Anna. It was signed by... So did she play in both movies and did both signings for both parts? What? Sure. I don't know. Just realized it. Okay. So, there were three different autographed prints you could get. Plus, um, there's a possibility for a rare movie poster insert, which obviously I did not get. Um, this is the variant Captain Spaulding print. And then here's the variant Georgie print, which I already ordered. And I'm okay that I didn't get it. And the My Bloody Valentine Heart in a Box. Uh, roses are red, violets are blue, one is dead, and so are you. Um, and then the giveaway is a Tobin Bell signed handsaw inscribed jigsaw, which would be awesome to win, but I never win any of that stuff. So my luck is crap. <laughs> so um, the franchises for next month are Trick or Treat, The Strangers Pray at Night, Gremlins, Stephen King's Pet Cemetery, and The Return of the Living Dead. So, there they are. So, yeah. Those were the two BAM boxes of the month of February 2018. Um, so, yeah, like I said, I'm really, I really like that it print. You know, though, well, obviously, who doesn't, but I mean... So yeah, favorite item by far out of both boxes, and then I did really like the um, Harley calendar print, and yeah, I mean, they're pretty good boxes, they, they were good boxes, you know, it's nice to have like two prints instead of, you know, just the one, and then it was extra, like I said, missing the pins and everything like that, but pretty satisfied, I'm not going to complain or argue with it. Yeah. So, that is it. For this video. Thank you for watching. If you want, you can comment, like, subscribe. Um, anything that I talked about that I didn't absolutely love, and we all know what two items I really loved, will be up for um, trades or sales, so just let me know. Um, yeah, thanks for watching. Bye, YouTube.